Western Missouri is welcoming a resident back home tonight from a daring trip. Paul Schwenison was in Ukraine for about a month after the Russians invaded. He just got home last night. In a place where what's most likely around the corner is a friendly face. Just going from one extreme to the other. Western Missouri is welcoming home Paul Schwenison from Ukraine where danger was never far away. Your mind is just, you know, turning somersaults trying to figure out how to deal with it all. We talked to Paul a few weeks ago when he was still wearing body armor in Kyiv, doing whatever he could to get supplies to the front lines. He was using his experience in the U.S. military deployed in Afghanistan to help turn back the Russians' initial attack on the Ukrainian capital. I think it was the right time and, and the intentions were in the right place and we were able to do, you know, a considerable amount of good. Paul's Facebook feed shows how efforts like his peppered already damaged and destroyed neighborhoods with rations of hope, even if just for a little while. This is what Russians are, are killing civilians with. Back home, those posts kept neighbors like Lori Stanislav up to date. Everybody in town, it was like a daily thing. You know, how's Paul? Has anyone heard from Paul? Weston has plenty to celebrate tonight. Now that Paul and his signature cowboy hat are back in town, what happens next, though, in Ukraine is unclear. In a sane world, it would make them think twice. But the Russians don't seem to be acting sane on any measure of this of this engagement. Paul's plans feel a little more certain. He says he plans to eventually go back this time, potentially with his wife, to help coordinate his work on the ground. They had success with her working from Weston. He says, though, it would be safe enough for her to do that work from Poland as well.